Rachel Zegler continues to go viral. It seems like every day there's another clip get, that gets dug up, another interview of hers where she's trashing Snow White, either the character or the movie or something. And even headlines you're starting to see like this, Rachel Zegler is officially Disney's new Brie Larson. They have quickly found a very, a very unlikable and insufferable replacement in Rachel Zegler. You got articles like this, Snow White actor Rachel Zegler all but admits she hates the character in resurface video. You have stuff like this, Snow White star Rachel Zegler angers conservatives and Disney fans, insists the movie's prince stalks her character. Young star also wants to get paid every hour the film streams. This is another thing. This went viral yesterday. The new Snow White hates Snow White. Are you ready for this, Jeremy? I've seen it. I mean, you know, the, the original cartoon came out in 1937, yes. and very evidently so. <laughs> um, there is a big focus on her love story um, with a guy who literally stalks her. <laughs> yeah. Weird. Weird. God. Weird. Weird. <laughs> it is. A, that's the interpretation that a 22-year-old who only watched Snow White one time when she was like five or six and then never watched again until after she was making this movie. That's her interpretation of the movie. Uh, but let's keep going. Super weird. So we didn't do that this time. <laughs> so, no, so no prince or a different kind of prince? We have a different approach to what I'm sure a lot of people will assume is a love story just because like we cast a guy in the movie. Right. Andrew Burnap, great dude. Yeah. Um, it's Now this guy's not the prince. He's just a random dude. So there is not going to be a prince in this movie. That That's not going to happen because they want to be about her her agency of course it's got to be about her finding her agency so uh, it's one of those things that i think everyone's going to have their assumptions about what it's actually going to be but uh it's really not about the love story at all which is really really wonderful and whether or not she finds love along the way is anybody's guess until 2024 um all of andrew's scenes could get cut who knows it's hollywood baby god <laughs> like this is somebody again i don't know if you saw this one too jeremy I did not see the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I did see this God, one. This one is wild. At least, at least when it came to woke Little Mermaid Halle Bailey, at least she told people, whether it was real or not, I loved Little Mermaid growing up. I loved the animated movie. It was so amazing. This is Rachel Zegler. Original cartoon. I think I watched it once and then I never picked it up again. <laughs> like, I'm being so serious. I watched it once and then I went on the ride in Disney World, which was called Snow White Scary Adventures doesn't sound like something a little kid would like, was terrified of it, never revisited Snow White again. So I watched it for the first time in probably 16, 17 years when I was doing this film. It's no longer. Good Lord, man. She despises it. She actively hates it. Yeah. How would you hire some? Well, never mind. This right. It's Disney, of course. This is this is the this is the standard. You have to hire people that hate the property in which they are getting involved in, and they hate the fan base. Yeah, that makes sense. What's wild is that they're not even doing promotion for this or anything, right? This movie doesn't come out for another year at least. Like these are just old things she's said. Imagine mm -hmm. what's gonna happen when the strike ends and she starts doing more interviews, or when she's actually promoting this movie. Imagine how bad it's going to get. Yeah. Before it's even started, this movie is already destined for failure. Again, because yep. it's not just angry right-wingers on YouTube. It's a lot of people. There's a lot of Disney fans coming out. There's a lot of uh, people on the other side that are coming out and saying, hey, why are you so disrespectful towards Snow White? That's a classic, timeless, endless tale that a lot of people have a lot of us grew up with and we loved why are you saying that about the character you're supposed to be portraying it's a fucking nightmare it is and it's only going to get worse and i'm okay with that she's insufferable she is definitely taking uh the brie larson template and it's going to hit another level of course there's a lot of older stuff it'll be interesting to see when she does any newer stuff once i guess the writer strikes over i guess you can't say anything right now right you can't, you do, can't any do anything to promote Right. That's, okay. that's the rules with the strike. You can't like any interviews you're seeing right now or, you know, things that are doing for promotion were recorded before the strike. They even have to be straight up about that to let people know so no one gets in trouble. But yeah, until the strike ends, they can't do anything. What a disaster. Good job, Disney. Another wonderful pick uh, to represent your brand. You just keep knocking it out of the park. Another banger.